듣고 있죠. President, please be seated. President, o The court is back in session. Reprise de l'audience. And once again, the floor is given to the defense team for Mr. Kyo Sung p o n to put questions to this witness. You may now proceed. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Bonjour. Thank you, Mr. Bonjour, President. Madame Saosak. Good morning. Um, je m'appelle Anta Guisset et je suis um, co-avocat international de Monsieur Kyo Sung Pan. C'est à ce titre que je vais vous poser quelques très brèves questions. Ma première question euh, a trait à un événement que vous avez évoqué euh, avec euh, Monsieur le procureur euh, national. Euh, vous avez indiqué avoir été euh, arrêté pendant une dizaine de jours. Et dans le cadre de votre entretien avec euh, les enquêteurs, des coups d'instruction, vous avez évoqué plusieurs personnes qui avaient été arrêtées en même temps que vous, et vous avez évoqué une certaine grand-mère Che. Est-ce que vous pouvez nous indiquer qui c'était cette personne et comment vous la connaissiez À l'attention des interprètes, peut-être, pour éviter les problèmes de traduction. Che s'écrit C-H-E, accent circonflexe en français, et son nom se trouve sur le document E3-7780. In fact, uh, Jay Jai was uh, called together with me to an area to a pagoda on Long Tree Pagoda. Et ma question était de savoir qui était cette personne, qui était cette personne, qui était cette personne, pardon, et comment vous la connaissiez. Dans votre déclaration E3-7780, donc LERN en français, 00250601 ERN en anglais 00235512 ERN en Khmer 00233296 Vous évoquez l'origine ethnique de cette personne est-ce que vous vous en souvenez ก็ខ្ញុំមិនបានដងប្រវត្តគាត់ដែរគាត់ថាគាត់ជនជាតិចាម et vous confirmez que, comme vous, euh, à un moment, elle a été libérée. C'est bien exact Vous avez évoqué euh, toujours à la même page euh, en français la même page également en anglais et en Khmer à l'ERN 00233297. Vous avez évoqué un certain nombre de cadres de base. Donc je vous prie de m'excuser pour la prononciation et je vais donner les ERN pour que les interprètes ne soient pas perdus. Vous avez parlé de Mon. Coq, Choi et Ni, en disant qu'ils étaient tous cadres de base. Donc ma première question est relative à Mon. Quel poste occupait-il exactement 
what was his position exactly? Mon Gatia, but then Pom, no Pom Long Tree. Answer Mon was the village chief in Unlong Tree. Mon chef du village de Unlong Tree. Est-ce que c'est à lui um, que vous avez parlé lorsque vous avez été uh, arrêté? Was it to that Ou est-ce que c'est à quelqu'un d'autre? Ou est-ce que c'est à quelqu'un d'autre? Ou est-ce que c'est à quelqu'un d'autre? Donc c'est à lui que vous avez parlé, n'est-ce pas So he's the person you spoke to, is that correct? Yeah. Answer, yes, that is correct. Uh, it was Mon. C'était Mon. Est-ce que vous savez qui était le chef de Mon? Do you know who Mon's chief was? Et ce Choi, est-ce que vous pouvez indiquer quel était son poste exact? And can you tell us what Choi's exact position was? What can I call him? Answer. He was the uh, commune chief of Prek Choi. Vous avez également évoqué Koch. Quel était son poste Koch. exact What was Koch's position? Ten Pom Lai, Ten Pom Village Chief. Di Mui. He was the village chief. Chef the de village chief. C'était le chef de village. Uh, together with uh, Mon Avec in Mon Long Trier. Ah, on Long Trier. Et enfin Ni. And Quel était son poste exact? What was his position? Answer. He was the uh, chief of militia. C'était le chef de la milice. Tout à l'heure, et euh, même hier, vous avez évoqué à plusieurs ago, reprises le fait que vous étiez week, euh, euh, un membre de village ordinaire, que vous vous occupiez de votre travail. Est-il exact de dire que vous n'avez jamais participé à aucune réunion avec Mon, Koch, Che et Ni augmenter la production pour passer de 3 à 6 tonnes par hectare. Donc tout à l'heure, lorsque vous avez répondu à so, ma consoeur des partis civils, que euh, vous supposiez que Mon faisait des rapports sur l'ethnie euh, de la population de votre village. Nous sommes d'accord que c'était simplement une supposition. Vous-même, vous n'avez jamais vu ces rapports et vous ne savez pas exactement si Mon a fait un rapport au chef que vous ne connaissiez pas. Quite aware of the fact that Mon wrote yeah, reports the on people to achieve that you were not aware of. Is that correct? Answer: so, Yes, that is correct. Oui, c'est exact. Je vous remercie. Je n'ai pas d'autres questions, Monsieur le Président. Thank you. I have no further questions for the witness, Mr. President. Thank you, Mr. President. Merci, Monsieur Good le morning. Président. Witness. Bonjour, Monsieur le témoin. This morning, you made mention about the arrests of Vietnamese Ce and uh, the transfer of them to their home country, that is Vietnam. Vers leur pays d'origine, le Vietnam. Could you tell the court pourriez-vous dire à la who told you that the uh, Vietnamese uh, were arrested and sent Qui back home? que les Vietnamiens avaient été arrêtés et envoyés Answer. Réponse. 
It was not the village chiefs who told us about that. Ce n'était pas les It was chefs de village ours, uh, qui nous l'ont rapporté. I thought that uh, the Vietnamese uh, were arrested and sent back to Vietnam. Nous no one told us about that. Nous pensions que les alliés ont envoyé au Vietnam. Personne ne nous l'avait rapporté. Question. Question. Who told you? about the arrest and transfers of Vietnamese. Uh, could you tell Qui the names of de those people? Et du transfert des Vietnamiens. Pourriez-vous nous donner les noms de ces personnes? Answer. It was a rumor from one another when we were in the dining hall All of us uh, were whispering to one another that Vietnamese uh, had been arrested and sent back to Vietnam. We were afraid after hearing that information. I, together with uh, Ye Ye, uh, discussed about that matter. Ye Ye, who was in the, my group, uh, discussed the matter with us about uh, the Vietnamese people arrested and sent back to Vietnam. Uh, we learned from the grandmother or Ye Ye in Khmer. Council, when did that happen? Answer. It was Uh, between 1975 uh, to 1978, when we were working together in the cooperatives and when we were having uh, meals to get together collectively. Council, thank you. A while ago, you said Ni was militiaman chief. Could you? specified about the position, whether or not he was uh, the uh, militia, militia chief in the commune or in the village? Chef de la dans la ou dans le village? Answer. Réponse. Ni uh, was Ni the chief of militia within my village. Le chef de la dans mon village. Council, thank you, uh, Madame Wines. Uh, Mr. President, Madame I am done with my questioning. Le President. President. Thank you. Madame Sao Sa, the hearing Madame of your Sao testimony Sao as a witness has come Votre to an end. Your testimony fin. will contribute to Celle truth in this case. You may be accused, you may return to your residence or to any destination you wish to go. I wish you good health. Nous vous souhaitons bonne santé, good luck and prosperity. Bonne chance Court officer, et please prospérité. work with the vessels to send uh, Madame Sousa back to her restaurant or to any destination she wishes to go. And next, the chamber will start to hear 2TCW-241. Court officer, please invite the witness into the courtroom.
Susai lok dalam badan arwah Pak Wini atau lok semua ini. Good morning, Mr. Civil Party. What is your name? Monsieur la partie civile. Bonjour. Quel est votre nom? Civil Party. My name is Jung Yang Jat. Je me nomme Jung Yang Jat. President, Mr. Jung Yang Jat. Monsieur Jung Yang Jat. When were you born? Quelle est votre date de naissance? Answer. I cannot recall it. President, how old are you this year? Answer. I am 13 or 14 years old, Mr. President. Said a civil party. President, how old are you this year? Mr. Civil Party. Monsieur la partie civile. Answer. I am 52 years old, Mr. President. President. Thank you, Mr. Jung Yang Chai. Where were you born? Jung Yang Chai. Où êtes-vous né? Answer. Sri Takwaj, village by Kri Commune, Kampong Leng District. President. And what is your current address? Where are you living now? Où habitez-vous aujourd'hui? Answer. I am living in Kanda village. J'habite dans le village de Kandal. Kampung Chenang district. Kampung Chenang province. President, what is your current occupation? Quelle est votre profession? Answer. I am a worker, Mr. President. Je suis ouvrier, Monsieur le Président. President, thank you. President, merci. Mr. Yung Chai. Monsieur Yung Chai. Please. Listen carefully to the question before you give your answer. By doing so, you may allow time for interpreters to interpret into three working languages, Khmer, English, and French. So you need to pause a little while so that interpreters can fully interpret what you say. What are your parents' names? De vos parents. Answer. Réponse. My father's name is Jung Yang Suo, Jung Yang and my Suo mother's Ving Tiko. Ving Tiko for my mother. President, what about President. your wife? What is her Votre name, femme. and how many Quelle children do you have? Answer. My current wife's name is Ming Yan Loi, and I have Ming eleven Yan children, Mr. Mr. President. Et j'ai huit enfants, Monsieur le Président. President, Mr. Chung Yang Child, at the end of your testimony, as the civil party, you are entitled to make a victim impact statement, statement during the democratic Cambodia between 7 April, 17 April 1975 to 1979, the 6 January 1979, if you wish to do so. Mr. Chuang Yang Chad, have you ever been interviewed by the investigators of the ECCC's OCIJ. Du bureau des juges d'instruction des CETC. Answer: Yes. Réponse: Oui. I can recall some information which I provided to the investigator. Not all of them. President. I want to know whether or not you have been interviewed by investigators of the OCIJ of the ECCC. Answer: Yes. Réponse: Oui. Lawyer Sok. Kung is the lawyer who interviewed me, and later on, lawyer Lima interviewed me. President, so you did not provide information to the investigators of the OCIJ of the ECCC. In fact, you were interviewed by your lawyers.
Mr. Jun Yang Jai on Mr. the basis of internal rule 91, based of the internal rules, so the chamber gives the floor to political lawyers to put questions before other parties. Political lawyers and uh, co-prosecutors will have uh, two sessions to put the question to this witness, this civil party rather. You may not proceed, a political lawyer. Merci, Monsieur le Président. C'est notre consoeur Liman Guyenne qui va Thank poser you, des questions Mr. à la partie President. civile aujourd'hui. It is my colleague Liman Guyenne who will put questions bah, to the party today. Yes, you can now proceed, uh, lawyer. President, please. Mr. Chung Yong Chet, are you of Vietnamese ethnicity? Monsieur Chung Yong Chet, êtes-vous d'origine vietnamienne? I was uh, ethnically uh, Vietnamese. Are both of your parents ethnically Vietnamese? Yes, you are right. Now, you mentioned that you were born in Sai Tokoi village in Kampong Leng district, Kampong Shnang province. Can you tell us where your parents were born? Answer. Yes, I can tell you. My parents were also born in Sai Tokoi, Kampong Leng. District. district de Campon and I was born in the same uh, village, commune, and village, district. Même commune, même district. What language did you speak at home growing up? I lived in that uh, village, I uh, spoke uh, both uh, Khmer and uh, Vietnamese. What language did you speak with your parents? Answer. I spoke uh, Vietnamese. Did your parents also Question. speak the Khmer language? Yes, they uh, could speak Réponse. Khmer. They live in a village adjacent to Khmer villages, so they also spoke Khmer. And what was... No, no, no. President, uh, Madame... Uh, lawyer, rather, uh, please also turn off uh, your microphone uh, after you put the question, and please also pause a little while before you put another question so that interpreters can fully interpret what uh, all of you say. Certainly, Your Honor. Thank you. What level of Khmer language skills did your parents have? Answer. They could speak 60% of Khmer. Question. Ils pouvaient parler 60% de Khmer. Did your family follow any Vietnamese traditions? Question. Votre famille respectait-elle des, tra des traditions vietnamiennes quelconques? Answer. They uh, practiced a uh, uh, Vietnamese religion. Réponse, ils pratiquaient la religion vietnamienne. And what is the Vietnamese religion? Et quelle est-elle, cette religion vietnamienne? Answer. They uh, celebrated uh, Vietnamese New Year Réponse, and uh, the uh, All Souls Day, that is Saint Kabal Tuk. 
Now, the Vietnamese use a calendar which is a little bit different from the Western calendar and from the Khmer calendar. Uh, could you tell us how the Vietnamese calendar is different? The uh, calendar of uh, French people uh, is different from the calendar of Vietnamese people. How are the calendars different? For answer. Usually, uh, the uh, celebration of any ritual um, of a French calendar is one month before the Chinese calendar. So, the Vietnamese calendar is the same as the Chinese calendar? Bah. Answer, yes, réponse, that is oui, right. Exact. Now, you said that the calendars were one month different. For example, if today is the 7th of December in the Western calendar, what day is it in the Vietnamese calendar? Answer. It réponse. falls on uh, uh, the 26th uh, of uh, October in the Vietnamese calendar. So the Vietnamese calendar has dates that are earlier than the Western calendar. Is that correct? In fact, it was it usually it is uh, one month after the celebration uh, according to the uh, Western calendar. Now, Mr. Chung Young Chet, have you got brothers and sisters? Or did you have brothers and sisters? Answer. Yes, I have uh, siblings, uh, male and female siblings. Is it correct that in 1975 you had two older brothers and two older sisters, and that you were the youngest in your, chi in your youngest child in your family? Answer. Yes, I have uh, two elder brothers and uh, elders, two elder sisters. I am, and I uh, am the youngest in the family. In 1975, you were 13 or 14 years old. Is that right? 13 or 14 years exact. Answer. Yes, that is right. Do you know? When each of your brothers and sisters were born. Connaissez-vous la date de naissance de chacun de vos frères et sœurs? Answer. I do not recall uh, the date of uh, their births. Je ne me souviens pas de leur date de naissance. You told the court the names of your mother and your father earlier. I'd like to go through the names of each of your siblings, starting with the oldest brother. What was your oldest brother's name? Notamment votre frère aîné, le plus aîné, l'aîné. Comment s'appelle-t-il? My first elder brother was Jung Yang Hoi. My second brother was Jung Yang Loi. Jung Yang Loi. And the next elder brother was Jung Ji. Yang and the fourth one was Jung Tilit. Then it was uh, me. Question.
Your family was ethnic Vietnamese. Votre Did any member of your family have Vietnamese nationality? Est-ce que des membres de votre famille avaient une nationalité? My ancestors were Vietnamese, and for me, I have five siblings. Quant à moi, j'ai cinq frères et sœurs. Do any of your family members have Vietnamese nationality or Vietnamese citizenship? Qui ont la citoyenneté ou la nationalité vietnamienne? At that time, I did not reach the age. However, through my other two uh, brothers, mes deux autres frères got uh, the age and they received this uh, letter during the time that is during the Sankomori regime. Sous le sous le régime de Siena. I'd just like to move to uh, the issue of your places of residence. You said you residence. were born in Say the Khoi village. Dans le village de Say the Khoi. How long did you and your family live Pendant in this village? Temps, vous et votre famille avez-vous vécu dans ce village? I lived there and I only moved to Kanda village in 1975. I was in Recite Koi for a long while. However, we were mistreated by the Khmer Rouge, then we fled to live near the Khmer Rouge. Could you explain Question. how your family was mistreated by the Khmer Rouge in Say Takoy village? Your family was mistreated by the Khmer Rouge in the village of Say Takoy. Question. Response. Uh, they mistreated us and they said that if we remained living there, everyone of us would be killed. For that, we were afraid that everyone from the village fled to the village, including my family and myself. Do you recall the composition of Say Tokoi village? For example, how many Vietnamese families lived there and how many Khmer families? Et combien de familles Khmer y habitaient There were more than 30 Vietnamese families, however, there were more uh, Khmer families living in the village and in the uh, commune. Dans la commune Though dans I did not know the total number of the Khmer families. When your Question. family moved from Say Takoy village to Kandal village, Kandal, were there also other families that moved there at the same time? Ont en même temps. Everybody uh, came to Kampung Chnang that is to live in Réponse. Kandal village. Tout le monde est allé au village de Kandal. Tout le monde Vietnamese est parti pour families, Kampung Chnang. Families, Il y avait des familles vietnamiennes, des familles Khmer families et des familles Chan aussi to live in that qui village. venaient vivre dans ce village. Now you said earlier that Question. you were told that if you remained in the village, you would all be killed. Si vous demeuriez dans le village, Could you explain who told you that tués. and who they said it to? Et à qui cela a-t-il été dit C'était le groupe de Tapim. Tapim était responsable du district de Kampong Leng. Now, during the uh, Khmer Rouge times, Kampong Leng, Leng district was also known as District 18. Is that correct? District 18. Is that correct? 
réponse. Yes. Oui. Do you remember Question. the dates or the month Vous that your family de moved de from Saigatoy village to Kandao village? Quand votre famille est partie du village de Saigatoy pour se rendre au village de Kandao. I do not recall the month. However, in 1975, Mais I moved to Kampong Chinan and stayed there a little bit uh, over a month. J'y suis resté un mois, un peu de plus. To puis Dan. nous avons été évacués ailleurs. What did you do during that month Question. at Kandao Village? Qu'avez-vous fait pendant ce mois que vous avez passé au village de Kandao? Réponse. I went to catch fish. Je suis allé pêcher. You said that uh, you were evacuated to Da village. Donc, vous avez dit Could que vous avez été évacué au village de Da. Actually chose to Vous pouvez nous dire si vos parents ont choisi de partir du village de Kandal au village de Da. Or whether they were forced ou to. ont-ils été forcés de partir By that time, we were forced. À ce moment-là, nous avons été forcés. They said that uh, long live en fait, uh, some like O, and we all had to leave. For those who live in the river, had to go uh, following the river. Suivre la rivière. Those on land had to move uh, Donc, by ceux land. Ceux qui étaient au bord de l'eau devaient suivre l'eau, et ceux qui étaient sur terre devaient suivre la terre. Donc village. nous sommes allés au village de Da. Could you describe what happened Question. during the forced relocation to Da village? Cette, euh, ce transfert forcé vers le village de Da. We were taken to Da and we were divided into uh, uh, groups there. Nous avons été séparés Some had to go and Certains uh, go fishing aller while pêcher. other had to work uh, on land. travailler sur la terre. So they divided and they selected uh, certain families to uh, go and catch fish while others work on land. D'autres familles devaient cultiver. How many families Question. were forcibly relocated Combien to Dar village from Kandal village? Combien de familles ont été transférées de force du village de Kandal au village de Dar? Numéro. I cannot recall that uh, there were many families. There were about a thousand families. Un millier de familles. Do you recall Question. what the ethnic compositions of those thousand families were who were relocated? Do you know how many of them were Khmer and how many of them were Vietnamese families? Réponse. Since uh, there were uh, many, many families, I cannot recall the ethnic composition. Je ne pas vous dire quelle était la composition. Do you recall Question. whether there were more Vietnamese families than Khmer families in that area? Dans cette région. It was likely Réponse. that there were more Vietnamese families. Et il est probable qu'il y a eu plus de familles vietnamiennes. Now, how far away Question. was Da village from Kandal village? Le village de Da du village de Kandal. It was about 15 kilometers Réponse. away, or it Environ could be roughly a little 15, bit 15 less kilomètres. than 20 Peut kilometers. Un peu moins de 20 kilometers. And the people, Question. when they were transferred to Da village, Dar, did the Vietnamese people live together with the Khmer people, or did they live separately? Khmer, ou vivaient-ils séparés? For my groups, we were all uh, 
Dans mon groupe, nous étions tous des familles vietnamiennes de Tapim. Ta L'autre ta ta groupe était composé de familles... Il y avait un mélange plutôt. Il y avait des familles Khmer et des familles vietnamiennes. Dans l'autre groupe, of da village? Qui, comment, qui était responsable du village de Da? Je ne me souviens pas du nom du chef de village, village in le, district. ni non plus le chef du you village de Pim dans l'autre village. Was Question, he vous, the village vous avez chief parlé de Ta Pim, était-il le chef commune? de village de la commune de Da? He was the chief of the Pol Pot group. Il était le chef du groupe de Pol Pot. Now, this Da village Question. was it still within District 18? Était-il toujours dans le District 18? Yes, Da was located oui. in District 18. Da était dans le District 18. And could Question. you describe where it was geographically? Où était-il? Was it on a mountain? Était-ce sur une montagne? Yes, uh, Pumda oui. was located at a de mountain. Était sur une montagne. And to the east, it was uh, Kaip, a mountain. Il y avait la montagne de Kongkaip. And through the uh, lower part of the village lay the Kampong Leng district. Il y avait le district de Kampong Leng. What were the living Question. and working conditions on Da village les at Kongkep Mountain? Au village de Da sur la montagne de Kongkep. I lived in Kongkaip uh, village together with Kankaip my uh, siblings ma and my parents. Et mes and I stayed uh, watch uh, the house and we Je were given a letter of gruel for morning, for la lunch la and for meal time. And the gruel was mixed with the morning glory. De, uh, soupe de riz, le matin, le midi, le what soir, sort of work did you do at the mountain? Question. Quel était le travail que vous faisiez à la montagne. Oh, you get... I was asked Réponse. to clear the lands to On grow a potato. De défricher la terre pour y cultiver de la pomme de terre. Now, how long Question. did your family live Combien at Da village on Kankat Mountain before they were killed? Avant qu'ils soient tués. It was Réponse. a bit more than a month. Un peu plus mois. During your Question. family's time on the mountain, did they Pendant ever le temps, suspect that the montagne. whole family would be killed? Elle douté que la famille au complet serait tuée? No, Réponse. they never thought non, about that. Non, jamais pensé. If we knew that we were to be si killed, we would run off tuer, into the forest, either forêt. to be eaten by a tiger, pour but uh, we tigres, did not know anything about uh, that. Nous rien we did not anticipate it. Nous ne pas. Nous, 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 nous en pas. Mr. Chung Yong Chet, Question. I'd like Monsieur you Chung to describe in detail que vous nous the events dans les leading to the death of your family, starting from the beginning. Donc, Could you début. please tell the court when it was, the approximate date or date, month that your family were gathered together and killed? Et veuillez prendre le temps qu'il vous faut. Ah, my, I'm not a chip. Show no. My 
parents were clearing the land and in fact my father had a fever my father had a fever moi aussi j'étais malade and next morning there were eight men coming with eight guns huit and an sont axe. venus avec huit euh, avec des, des fusils et des, des they haches. demanded my father to go first and after he left premier. the house he Quand was tied. Quand il est sorti tied. de la maison, my on l'a attaché. Ensuite, ma mère a perdu connaissance et on a attaché chacun des membres de la famille. Et chacun des membres de la famille, ils utilisaient une corde Then réservée au bétail. Into, Puis uh, ils les ont mis en ligne et les ont fait marcher. So that morning, were all of your family matin, in the same donc, house when they were, when your father was maison, called to come out by the eight de sortir, quand men? Huit hommes ont demandé à votre père de sortir de la maison. Réponse. Yes, we oui. were all there uh, together, tous là, tous and that happened at eight o'clock in the morning. C'était à 8h du matin. Could you describe these eight men? Where were Question. they from? Vous What were they hommes? wearing? D'où venaient-ils? Quels vêtements portaient-ils? It was the Tapim's group. They le wore de Tapim. black uniform and they noirs. had a scarf around their neck. Autour du cou. Were they armed Question. with any weapons? Avaient-ils des armes? The, the eight of them had eight guns, an axe, and grenades. Et des grenades. Could you describe what they did Question. after they called your father out of the house and after he came out of the house? Quand ils ont appelé votre père qu'il sorte de la maison. Appelé votre père qu'il sorte de la maison. They uh, took him to uh, near the a pit where ils they would execute him, and it was about 100 meters away, uh, near the foothill. However, I did not see them kill my parents. When I uh, arrived at the pit, I la saw fosse, their dead bodies in the pit, that is, the bodies of my father, my mother, père, and ma my siblings. Et de mes frères et You said, you said earlier that these men tied your father que, up euh, and then did the same with the rest of your family. Could you describe the manner in which famille. they tied up your family? Ils ont votre They tied our hands behind the back with a rope that they used on cows. And all my sisters and uh, brothers were tied up. And then we were lined up in a queue and then they brought us into the forest. So did they tie Question. up each member of your family individually or did they also tie them up together in one line? Tous ensemble par la même corde en ligne? We were tied up individually, however, when we were walked there, we were walked into a single file in order to prevent from any of us escaping. On this particular day, did they do anything similarly with other families? Uh, 
as for uh, other families, I could not say if they had the forced work, probably they would be spared. Les autres and from de that day onward, la base du coup, I, my memory does not serve me that well. Ce jour-là, j'ai des problèmes de mémoire. Just going back to what happened outside of your family house, did you see the Khmer Rouge take any other families that day? Si Khmer Rouge ont emmené d'autres familles. Khmer Rouge. Maître Corbyn, le président, je m'oppose à l'emploi du terme. Uh, or at least should do that. Soit on peut um, décrire des gens from the word Khmer Rouge, especially when we're dealing um, in this de period 75. Cela, surtout lorsque l'on parle so, de période de um, 75. The Khmer Rouge is such going to do anything Khmer Rouge, with, with physical acts that um, rien, counselors are asking for. So we should, uh, the witness should describe parle, persons rather than an entity uh, called the Khmer Rouge. À la civile de décrire les personnes qui ont commis ces actes plutôt que des Khmer Rouge, cette entité. Mr. Chung Young Chet, you said there were eight cadres with your family that morning. Did you see these eight men deal with any other families in a similar way? That day, at 8 o'clock in the morning, Ce à a family uh, next door la uh, was tied up as a well. Aussi. The family composed of Cette famille, the father, the mother, père, and mère, two children. Deux enfants. Was that Question. family ethnically Vietnamese? Cette famille était -elle d'origine vietnamienne? Yes, they Réponse. were also oui. Vietnamese. Eux aussi, ils étaient Vietnamese. Was that Question. family tied up at the same time that your family was tied up? En même temps que les membres de votre famille? Ma réponse. Yes. Oui. You said Question. earlier that these eight cadres then walked you about one kilometer away to another place. Could you describe the place where they stopped you? They walked Réponse. us from uh, the house Ils to the forest and the distance was about forêt, a bit over one un kilometer. And we uh, were stopped about 100 uh, Suite, meters from the pit, and each of us will be taken one by one to be killed at the pit. Pour être tué à cette fosse. During that 100-meter walk, did any of the cadres say anything to yourself or your family or to the other family? No. Réponse. There non. were uh, four cadres who were guarding uh, our group, Il y avait quatre cadres and the qui other four cadres uh, would lead uh, one of us at a time to the pit and killed. Nous un par un à la fosse pour être tués. Could you describe question. what this pit looked like? How big was question. it? Quelle était sa taille? The pit was Réponse. three meters wide. La fosse trois mètres de and large. Uh, it's three, uh, three by 2.5, and the uh, depth par deux et demi was 1.5 meters. Mètre et demi de what did Question. the cadre do when you reached et this pit? What did the cadre do when you reached this pit? As I réponse. stated earlier, each of us will be taken there and killed. Dit, nous y était they would be uh, killed 
and tied and pushed the person détaché, into the pit. Et ensuite, jeté la personne and when it's my turn, I was ordered to kneel down. De me, and then they, uh, they felt my neck and then they used an axe Ils to hit uh, the nape of my neck three times. Pour frapper sur mon cou trois fois. Were you the last out of your family Question. to be told famille, to kneel by this pit? A a bord de la fosse? What order did they take the members of your family? Dans quel ordre ont-ils emmené les membres de votre famille? I was the uh, last person in my family, and by that time, all of the eight castrates were there. Tous and les they presumed place, that I was dead. Then they untied me, mort, they took away the rope and left. Détaché, ils ont emmené la corde et m'ont laissé là. By the time it was your turn, Question. and as you were kneeling Dans by the pit, pit what could you see inside the pit? Au bord de la fosse, que pouviez-vous voir à l'intérieur? I only uh, saw four of my family members and not the rest because they stacked uh, on top of another. I saw the dead bodies of my father, my mother le, and le my siblings. And I was the last person to be killed and dropped into the pit. Did you see the bodies of any of the Question. other family who were taken with your family that day? Aussi, des membres de cette autre famille qui étaient emmenés en même temps que la vôtre. No. Réponse. I non. I did not. Uh, it was possible that uh, possible they were stacked up to below the dead bodies of my parents. Leur corps était and by the time de mes parents, I was there kneeling at the pit, I felt dizzy. Et quand je me suis agenouillé au bord de la fosse, j'étais Now you described before that when it was your turn, Question. you were forced to kneel down on your knees by the pit. And, you, and one of the cadre pulled your legs from behind you. Can you describe what then happened? I said that I was ordered to kneel down. And after I knelt down, they pulled genoux, my uh, legs. By that time, I lost my balance jambes, and my head uh, moved a bit forward. Then they fell. They uh, napped on my neck. They hit it three times. They dropped me off into the pit. Then they untied me. You said before that when you Question. dropped into the pit, you had lost consciousness. Dans la fosse, when did you regain consciousness? Quand avez-vous repris connaissance? It was Réponse. around uh, four o'clock in the afternoon when I regained uh, my consciousness. Là que I could uh, not walk. Je I ne had a very severe pain très mal. Uh, at my uh, neck. It Au was swollen. Était gonflé. Then after that, I walked day and night et through the uh, village, and then de I Kou, entered the house of Tali. Now, at the time that all of this happened, Question. you were only 13 or 14 years old. Que 13 ou 14 ans. Could, you, could you let the court know what it was that you were thinking and feeling course, at the time ce, that you regained consciousness in this mass grave? Vous avez repris dans cette fosse commune. Frankly speaking, Réponse. I did not think of anything. I, vrai, je ne à I, I was just reborn. Comme si so, né à I walked that 
night and Cette I nuit-là, j'ai marché. Reach, uh, the, uh, floating, uh, Je suis arrivé village. au village flottant I vietnamien. J'ai vu Then they helped me. Et Ils m'ont aidé. They gave me some modern uh, medicine des médicaments and modernes also traditional et aussi de la médecine traditionnelle pour me soigner. Who was this Mr. Tali who helped you? Et qui était cette personne, M. Tali, qui vous a aidé? lived in the floating village in order to make to catch fish and to make fermented fish. When I reached that location, I told them that all of my family members had been killed and that I was hit, but I survived. Then he used uh, some uh, tree leaves uh, to uh, treat uh, my swollen neck. President, uh, thank you. The time is appropriate for our lunch break. We take a break now and resume at 1.30 this afternoon. Court officer, please assist the civil party at the waiting room reserves for civil parties and witnesses and invite him back into the courtroom at 1.30 this afternoon. Security personnel, you are instructed to take you some porn to the waiting room downstairs and have him returned to attend the proceedings in this courtroom before 1.30. The court is now in recess.